dude, when we worked together in in San Francisco, and you sat down and you told a, a like a solid eight minute story about that Mexican man that went to school with you. Oh, I was talking about the first Mexican kid we had in our town, right? It's like I remember true. the first time we had a Mexican dude ever come to our school. Yeah. We got a Latino. <laughs> yeah. A yeah. Latino. Yeah, yeah. Name Not him. a family, Congra- just one kid. One Congratulations, kid. one guy. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I'm on the floor. But the problem, but the not the problem, but the thing that happened was this Mexican kid moved in named Nick, right? Came to our school during sex ed, I remember. He came in the classroom. Uh, yeah. Nicholas was his name, and he yeah. had a little bit of light facial hair. Nicholas, and everybody yeah. was fired up about that. <laughs> fired. <laughs> there was a lot of rumors and stuff going around, around about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And nobody had ever seen a Mexican kid in our town or whatever, you know? Wow. Because, yeah, people had never seen that on children, you know? It was like... <laughs> Wait, be light hair on the face? Yeah, like in science, they also taught you sex ed, right? So I remember he held up his hand during uh, sex ed, and he's like, Hey, Mr. Blackwell, what does pop that cherry mean? That's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> he asked the teacher, like, as serious as could be. He's like, like, that was the first question anybody, at first of us, any of it ever heard a Mexican kid talk in our life, right? What does pop that cherry mean? And then he... Uh, and so then everybody kind of like, uh, you know, like gravitated to learn about him. And he ended up banging some girl like in sixth grade, right? And she broke up with him, broke his heart. And then he started telling people he was a rapper. And he, he started to like rap music and he wore this t-shirt that said Nick the Rapper that he wrote on it with a marker, right? Uh-huh. He wrote on a white t-shirt with a marker, but he wrote Raper. Oh, on accident, he forgot a P. But he only put one P in it and it said Nick the Raper on it. The f- shirt that he wore. And they f- Expelled him. They expelled him. Yeah, rape for rape. Yeah, they fucking wrote rape and they expelled him. That was the first Mexican we ever had. But see, Mexican didn't play a part in it. He was a bad speller and he fucking was asking stupid questions. What does pop that cherry mean? Pop that cherry. Remember that saying? You don't hear that anymore, dude. You never hear that. Never saying. hear that. <laughs>